how to change your background colour and remove the axes on your SketchUp drawing. You'll mainly need to do this to take a screenshot um, and then send that screenshot to Layout to create an isometric drawing. So to start off, we're going to, um, we're in SketchUp obviously, um, we go to uh, View and we just unclick axes and you can see that that removes um, that removes your background uh, axes and those construction lines. So to put those back, you just click it on and you can see the blue, the green um, and the red axes there. So we want that off. Um, the next thing we need to do is change the background color because if you take a screenshot of this um, and then try and put that on A4 paper, it'll be gray against a white A4 piece of paper which won't look good. So you need to make the background white. So to do that, you go to Window, um, you scroll down to Fog comes up with this little display um, box here. You just click on um, uh, unclick display fog, sorry. Um, put that to 100. And then the background color we want to change. So we double click on that. And you can look through here for different types of colors, but I usually use the crayons. Um, I just think they're easier. And I go right down to the bottom here for white. Um, and just sometimes you have to double click that box and you can see there that it turns white and um, yeah, click on, I don't know why it's doing that. Um, we've got the background color on there, save that. And we have our background color. We can then go to camera, standard views, isometric, and we can then zoom in and take a screenshot, command shift four, and take a nice screenshot of that. We can then go to layout. Um, I have it down here, but all you have to do is Type in layout um, and that opens another program uh, like this. I've already got this saved so it appears for me um, but in my next video I'll show you how to set this up to do an isometric drawing.